I'm 3T. And I'm Mike Papa Foxtrot. Freeloaders is a regular look at what is or has been free to download from the PlayStation Network. We download the games and give them a play and see if they're worth the download bandwidth and time. This time we're looking at The Sims 4, a life simulation originally released in September 2014. The game has received mixed reviews since its release, with a majority of criticism directed towards the lack of content, though eight expansion packs have been released, the most recent in November 2019. Players create a sim character and control their life to explore different personalities, which change the way the game plays out. And these are our first impressions. And these really are your first impressions because you've never played a Sims game at all, you told me last week, is that right? Nope, never ever played a Sims game. I have watched, I think, a Sims game and I have played these kind of (laughs) time-wasting sort of games like, you know, Stardew Valley and Minecraft and things like that which are sort of, you know, basically... Well, I suppose like most games, really time wasting, but um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. but games we're not, where you're not to really sort of doing build... anything productive. <laughs> no, game, but games where you have to sort of build some kind of life around yourself. Yeah, um, that's sort of I'm RPG, really. That's what you do. Yeah, yeah I, I, I'm, but I never played, um, never played The Sims. But one of the things that's, uh, that shocked me when I was reading the burb is that this game goes all the way back to 2014. Yes, I was surprised when you said that because I had read 2017 The Sims 4, so maybe, uh, I don't mm. know, maybe there was some re-release or something. I, I, I'm not sure how that stacks up, uh, but there's obviously... Well, been... I mean, the, 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 the game was valued at um, a good 49 euros here, mm. so uh, okay. um, still um, still a high-end game. So um, Yeah, and mm. there's a, it gets a lot of play on YouTube channels. A lot of people do, uh, you know, Sims uh, videos and things, so... Uh, um, I don't know. I have played a Sims game. I can't remember which one it was. I'm pretty sure it wasn't the first generation, but I wouldn't be able to tell you exactly which. And it was it was okay at the time. Um, yeah, I, I sort of know what to expect and sort of hope that there's been some advancement. So um, I suppose we need to dive in. Uh, shall we? I mean, yeah, I mean, it, it 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 could be worse. It it could be Goat Simulator. Um, <laughs> I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to press X then. Let's see what happens. I guess we create a character. I think so. Now, here's the question. If we get asked to create a character, are we going to try and make uh, simulations of ourselves? Or are we going to go just massively off uh, off model? I have no idea. <laughs> I have, all I have is a, a diamond loading screen at the moment or a gemstone. Yes. And very jolly music, which I would like to turn down. <laughs> um, but it is jolly. It's very, very happy, isn't it? Yeah, so this is. Yeah, um, what, what, so, what's the significance of the gemstone? That we is know? Uh, that that I think is the icon that floats above your character's head to demonstrate that that is the uh, that is the person you are controlling. I think. Oh God, I have to accept a license end license. Yeah, I just have that as well. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, by seeds, by selecting plant box, brought in mode by gardening begins. What? Hang on. <laughs> Buy? Oh, buy. Oh, buy. yes. One of the little <laughs> things I did see um, was that um, that it did say in-game purchases. So um, okay, I'm so guessing this game is full of microtransactions. I'm uh, guessing. <laughs> hopefully not. Now, I've got a very strange screen here. Uh, I've got three options. Tiny Living, Discover University, or Realm of Magic. And I don't know what they mean. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad it was... Because I'm looking at a screen where... Where I have the same thing, tiny this guy living. Is take uh, a flash, firing a flash on his Polaroid-looking camera at me at intervals. And there's also a big play icon over to the right, which might be just some kind of, I don't know. What's all these expansion packs at the bottom? I don't own any of them, obviously. No, I got stuff. free stuff. Free stuff's unlocked. Um, <laughs> well, I mean, basically, uh, Realm of Magic looks like Harry Potter. Not really into that. No. Um, <laughs> Discover University. Um, that was the last. That was the last update to be released. That was released in 2019 because I wrote that down and deleted it well, in the blurb. Um, <laughs> should we just start at the top? So, then? Tiny living. tiny livings. Tiny living sounds about right. Let's um, see what happens when we we we. Oh, it's asking me questions again. Oh God, I just, <laughs> I've just got a spinning thing. It's is this an advert? Oh, what's happening? Have you, have you got sort of a bit of video playing? Um, yeah, it's showing me how to build a house and things like that and doing stuff and like... I, 
I thought you knew how this worked. Hey, I, it was a long time ago. I've got a horrible feeling. It might have even been PlayStation 2 uh, that I played The Sims on. So. <laughs> This does seem to be like um, these these lunatics that build tiny homes in like garden sheds and wheelbarrows and things. <laughs> They're very clever though. A lot of those, you know, when you take, take a oh, minibus yeah. and make a house, like very good. Okay, can I skip this video? That's How do what I skip I'm this? Video? Trying to do as well. Oh, all I've done is pause it. <laughs> yeah, I'm not pushing. But there seems to be somebody that doesn't understand how beds work, which yeah. is really. <laughs> I just want okay, to that... move on. Learn more. What yeah. happens if I click learn more? Oh god, don't make me do things. So I have I went to learn more and it's just kept saying I can go to the PlayStation store if I want to buy things, but well, I don't want to do that. Create a sim item. Oh um, what is happening? Build your small space. Alright, oh, hang on. Do, I've I I've gone back. I've gone back and I've scrolled across. Um, you see, on the other side of the lunatic with the Polaroid camera, underneath The Sims 4, oh. there's a great big, there's a great big arrow there. Yeah, well, that's what I said. There's like a play icon, but is that? Um, is that skip tutorial? Hey, I'm gonna skip the tutorial. <laughs> I just right. Now I've played The Sims 4, and I don't need help. Thanks. Yeah, that'd be fine. <laughs> I, I'm, are you skipping the tutorial? I am, if it will let me. So I've chosen, I've chosen it. What do I do next? Oh, continue. Hang on, don't ask, <laughs> don't ask me again. I can re-enable this option. No, and then tick. Yeah, not 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 keen on the uh, not keen on the user interface. And uh, oh, mm. spinning diamond and um, so progress bar. I have a silhouette saying hi. Would you like to create my story? We'll start with a fun personality quiz. Now, shall we do the fun personality quiz? Yeah, go on then. Let's. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do that. Shall we answer okay. the questions at the same time? <laughs> Let's start with an easy question. What age am I? Uh, elder. elder. <laughs> we both did it. Okay. Uh, the best food is... Surely, you, surely you're adult. <laughs> no, I, I'm making an elder. The best food is grown yourself, caught hook, line and sinker, or prepared by a chef. I'm going Oh, see, that. I've got a different question. I've oh. got... There's something I want to buy, but I can't afford it. What do I do? Um, steal it. <laughs> <laughs> Save money. Save my money oh, or steal it now. It. Or trade for it. I'm going to go with save my money. <laughs> <laughs> What's the first um, thing I do after a long day of work? Yeah. What's your next question? Um, <laughs> the world is in peril. What, what do I do? <laughs> wow, you've got really interesting questions. I've got rubbish ones. I'm going to cook dinner. I, I, I am the peril. <laughs> <laughs> I trade in others' fears or go undercover. Mm. Wow. Yeah, I'm going to go undercover, I think. Oh, um, I'm really disappointed. I thought you were going to be I am the peril. My next question is, <laughs> my neighbours didn't pay their bills and their utilities got shut off. Do I laugh at their predicament, offer to help, or avoid them at all costs? Um, oh, see, I'm just going to build a bastard. I'm going to say laugh at their predicament. <laughs> okay, well, I, I, I'm just going to build something random. I get asked out on a date. What's my response? Uh, go out, it could be fun. Um, ask who else they like or politely decline. Well, none of them are funny answers. No. Ask who else they like. Um, um, it's open mic night at the bar and I'm up. Do I tell my best jokes, slapstick comedy, or show off my musical talent? They're rubbish. I'm going to put slapstick. I'm going to go with slapstick with that one as well. Oh, you well, had that one. That one. Uh, Identically, yes. Okay. It's the weekend I have nothing to do? No, I've got how much voodoo... Do I do to my friends for my own amusement? And I'm going to go with all the voodoo. <laughs> it was all the voodoo, some voodoo, or little voodoo. I'm getting boring <laughs> ones now. How do I feel about love? Uh, keep my options open. Here we go. I'm going to have this guy. He's okay. going to be trisexual. I, He'll try anything I once spotted, in it. I spotted a rare creature. I must capture it. Take a picture. Can I keep it? I'm going to go with, can I keep it? <laughs> Pokemon. Um, how do I get by in life? Intelligence, hard work. I, inverted commas, borrow things, or I mooch off of friends. <laughs> <laughs> um, how do I act around groups of people? I ensure everyone's happy. I clam up. I take charge. Oh, I don't know. Um, I do a little bit of one and a little bit of three. I'm going to go with, <laughs> I take charge. <laughs> what do I do for fun? Boring. I'm going to put play games. Surf the web. Uh, what's the most important thing to me? My stuff, my family, my reputation. Well, obviously, my stuff. My stuff. 
I found an uneaten sandwich, but I don't know whose it is. Do I eat it, put it away, or leave it alone? I'm going to eat it because this guy's weird. Uh, what oh, role would I play me. in a criminal right heist? <laughs> <laughs> the mastermind, the muscle, the police informant. I'd like to think I was the mastermind. I was going to say, from past experience, you definitely would be. Um, the best music, radio, live, or video games. I'm just going to say radio. Boring. I think at I finished. Social, at social <laughs> events, I am the life of the party. The person who brings a guitar. Oh, my God. Picking fights. I like to think I'm the life of the party. And I think I'm finished. So now, oh, my God, I'm a hippie. Now we can assign gender. <laughs> I'd love to see what yours looks like. Gender, appearance, and select clothing. And, yeah, a name. So let's have a little play around with some of this. I don't really uh -huh. want to spend a lot of time making yep. a thing, but... Um, oh, yeah. I don't know, but this is part This is part of the game, isn't it? I've got no cursor. What the hell? What's happening? What's... How? Where's my cursor? How do I do th How do I do things? Controls. L3, it says. Click down L3 for the controls. Uh, huh? Uh, Did you have a joy? That's not helped me. Uh, uh, I know what right, down, left, and up are, but Gross they don't seem to do anything. Let me choose a thing. Maybe I have to choose the mask and try. No, that's not done anything. Oh, I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. Hello, my name is. Do I move around with something else? Oh, hang on. L. Oh no, that's undo and redo. That's not doing anything. What can I do? Public enemy. This sim wants to make oh, enemy. Oh, found it. Found it. Push the circle button. Oh. Personality. And Abba? Hang well, on. Hello, Hello, my name. Yeah. Hello, my name sure. is. How do I change that? <laughs> ah, here we go. Sure. First name, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've gone straight and to choosing a walk. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, no. Name's important. Last name <laughs> is... Um, um, oh, I don't know. Uh, helicopter boy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna. <laughs> Sorry, I just caught up with that. Uh, that'll be 3T, and the last name will be 3%. Okay. Uh, um, I'm going to stay. No, I'm going to stay. I'm going to stay point. I'm going to stay pointy triangle just because why not? Um, Sims create Vera Young Story. No. Uh, Default walk style. Oh, I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna mince. <laughs> I might mince. <laughs> What's that? That's not a happy walk. That's a weird. Walk. Uh, so I might. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I've That's gone gonna for a be my walk. walk. <clears throat> yeah, I've gone for sort of a mincy walk. Um, What's this? Sweet. What? Oh, is this personality? Quexy, I have no idea. I no idea. I'm clicking on them all. And oh, it's a voice. I don't know. You put in a bit of. Uh, oh, I've gone with trumpet. I'm going with trumpet. Crash. Party animal. Party animal. Gregarious, outgoing. Um, evil. <laughs> These sims become. I've just looked at my personality traits. The sim wants to throw and attend amazing parties. Okay. Um, I am gregarious. Um, I am outgoing. I am evil. <laughs> These sims become happy around sims with negative moodlets. <laughs> and I'm clumsy. These sims tend to fail more often. Oh, great. I'm set up for uh, failing. That's lovely. Uh, apparently, um, I am public enemy, uh, dastardly, a glutton, I'm a kleptomaniac, and I'm evil. That's good. So how do I change my appearance, though? No idea. Because down at the That's... bottom, it's not doing. Randomize filters, pencil play, gallery, open the gallery. Maybe we have to earn things to change them because. But it, she did say straight away, you can change my face, my gender, my Randomize. clothes. Randomize. Yeah. Um, there was. Um, when I go back to um, personality, there is nothing ah, you can okay. do. Okay. So. Uh, if you press the touchpad, then you will get a cursor, and then you can start selecting things. Are you joking? Are you telling me that? Are you telling us that that all this time, this pointless touchpad that we never use for anything? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> that is funny. That is too funny. Uh, um, I suppose because quite, no. it's now it, it trying to find the difference Need between a mouse uh, pointer and a controller. I, 
I'm going to stay female, I, I think. <clears throat> Let's have some strange I don't know hair. how to... I don't really know how to change anything. I'm trying to... I, I get it, but I can't get there. Do I click there? I can add another person. I'm going to have a blue rinse. That's good. There we go. And I'll stick to that. Hat. Still a hat on her. That's, I, again, I don't want to spend too long, because it'd be nice just to have a play around as well. Cool hats that she might like. I am just messing things up here. Oh, you hat. I see. I don't want a hat. How do I get rid of a hat? Oh no, she's stuck with a hat now. Get rid of it. Um, this is um. This There's is some Star more, Wars characters. Um, this is more um. It's more detail here than I really want there to be. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I just want. How do I get rid of a thing? Ah. I'm currently stuck on teeth. <laughs> I don't understand. I'm just gonna make. I'm gonna randomly assign oh. lots of weird stuff and uh, and just move on from there. I think because you could spend hours and hours, days making a sim. Uh, if you wanted to, so I'm just going to random. I'm stuck with a Christmas yeah. hat. I'm keeping the Christmas hat. Uh, yeah, I'm afraid this is um, not my. Uh, I, I, I mean, this is where I kind of. I, I. Oh, I can be Darth Vader. Yeah, I have the option to be a um, a Twi'lek um, character from Star Wars as well. Tops. Let's put some clothes on her. Come on, let's wear something fun. What's the jacket options have we got? I could be Bewitched. Have some double denim going on. Ugh, that's awful. Stick a hoodie on, it'll be fine. That. I don't really know what I'm doing. I don't either. <laughs> I'm just, I just want to get rid of these horrible flowery trousers and then I'm probably going to go and do something else. Um, something normal. There's no normal options, really. That'll do. I've bored of creating already. What shoes are there? I can put I can put makeup on. That's quite fun. You could do a lot of in, intricate uh, changing. You could probably, I mean, I know you can you can get very close to looking like real people. I think uh, if you really yeah. put a lot of effort in, Let's put some converse well, on there. I'm kind of happy with mine. It, I've got more hair than in the real world, and that's all that counts. <laughs> Uh, and I think I might just go straight over to play. What do you think? I'm on play now. I'm going to hit X and carry on. Uh, let's just do it then. Save and play. This weird girl with the... Uh, well, I say girl. She's an old lady. She's got a, um, an elf hat on, which I couldn't work out how to take hats off. I put a hat on as well. I put like a fedora on. I thought I changed my clothes, but apparently I haven't. Oh, I've got money. I got twenty thousand somethings. Oh, which and it's world? telling me where do I want to live in? Oh, I don't know. Willow Creek, Oasis Springs, or Newcrest? I'm going to just so we see different ones. Well, which one are you going to go for? And I'll go for something different. Um, I'm going to go. I'm going to go to the desert because I got a sensible hat on for it. Oh, all right, I'll stick with Willow Creek. Apologies, I've suddenly just developed hiccups. <laughs> That's the excitement of the game. <laughs> Clearly. So we've got uh, open slots that we can build houses in. Yeah. So. Um, well, I'm going to. They're very cheap houses. I'm going um, to bargain bends. Oh. I'm, I can buy a house that's already built, which is nice. <laughs> I can buy Sand Trip Flat, or I can buy the Nook Stone Resident, which is quite cheap. Um, or I can build a house. I'm going to buy one that's already built, I think. Yeah. Because that's... Um, I confirm. Guess. I've already... Uh, uh, it's furnished. I've already I've already got rid of most of my money. <laughs> oh, I've, I've built an empty plot. I assume that's what I had to do. So I haven't got a house. <laughs> I guess. Anyway... <laughs> Gain skills and something with a wabbit tablet. What the hell? Build mode. Here we go. I'm going to build a house. Um, if the game will let me. Okay. So you just sort of drift around the cursor and then you move where you want to go. Oh, I wish I hadn't done this. Uh, how do I build a wall? Can I go into the house? 
change sim. I can change the sim. Change outfit. Try on outfits. <laughs> looking, looking good can make a sim feel flirty. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I've got to do the whole thing from the bloody start. Walls and empty rooms. Wah. Oh, I don't like it. Square room. Just build a massive square room. That's all I want. Just, just give me somewhere to stand from the cold and the wet. What is happening? I hate this already. Spoilers. How do I spin it around? I, um, I'm lost. Oh, there's some clothes. Oh, Christ. I should have put tutorial mode on. I, I'm actually <laughs> really sad. Uh, that I didn't do that now. How do I move this around? I'm currently stuck changing my clothes. Ugh. And I don't know how I did that. Right. What is going on? on. Oh, so the, the very quick video showed like somebody dragging and dropping. Uh, oh, okay. I've made the wall bigger. But how do I spin the bugger? Can I go... Can I go and knock on a neighbor's door and say hello to them? Uh, move, move in household from my library. Visit residence. Visit residence. Go on, let's go visit. Oh, I just sunk it into the ground somehow. What's happening? I hate this. You can press square <laughs> on the plate. It just cut away. I don't understand why I've got a spinning diamond. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh god I've sunk it really deep into the ground I've basically got a sort of I don't know 12 foot by a lot of way. 5 Our foot box that I've just like d dented into the, the grass in this plot that I've bought Why didn't I didn't realise I could buy a pre-built house I thought part of it was having to <laughs> <sighs> I, I live here now option. get in there there's no door of course there isn't. How do I get a door? Door. Let's put a door in here. Yeah, any door will do. Ah. Ring leader. 70 vacation available payments. Reach task level 3 mischief. What? <laughs> I <don't understand. laughs> just want to put a door in. This is... um. This is far too complicated uh, for me, I'm afraid. Uh, having said that, um, I do like the way it controls. I do. I am enjoying the, um, the zoom and so on. I can go fishing, apparently. Where's my guy going? Oh, they, oh, they do Has have a life of their own sometimes. They're Has he just made his own decision? Where's he going? Yeah, you um, you can. So basically, you give them. You, you can make them do stuff, but they will also uh, just act based on the personality that you've given them. As far as I know, I am. Oh my god, this is just like my lowest gaming how moment ever. Do I? How how do I move the camera to there? Then? I did it, and I can't remember. Oh, how. like that. Ah, like that. Okay, it makes sense now. Go on, remind me because I can move the camera up and down, but I'm trying to. Um, well, the left, the, if, if you if you push the left, um, uh, the left uh, analog out of the screen, the camera moves. Um, if you push it left and right, you know, outside of the. Oh plane. yeah, no, I just, so I mean, you, the angle. Do you know how to move the angle? Because I'm moving the screen. Uh, yeah, you uh, use the right, the right one. No, 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 that's going up and down. How do I move the angle? Uh, yeah, you kind of zoom in close, and then you use a combination of them both. God. If that makes sense. Can I live in this house instead? This one's already built. <laughs> I don't know which one was my house and I don't know where my guy's gone. I have lost my guy. <laughs> this is this is the lowest the lowest gaming moment <laughs> I've ever ever experienced. I can't work out a single thing my guy. about this bloody game. I don't know where my guy's gone. He's up to something and I don't know where he's gone. I've lost him. I can't uh... sprint. The frigging camera. <laughs> oh, there we go. I can't, I can't find my guy. I have lost my guy. He decided to go off and do something on his own. I, can't find <laughs> <laughs> I hope he's not spending my money. <laughs> yeah, it's his money now. Short door. Yeah. Featureless fiberglass door. Yes, that will do. I don't care about the colour. I just want to put a door on this stupid thing. Simology. 
Apparently my guy's in a flirty mood. Um, Objects cannot be used at that height, apparently. Well, why are you letting me do it then? You just put a door oh, everywhere. That's how you find him. You click on him there. Okay. Let's go talk to that girl. She looks nice. Let's oh, go talk to her. My house is really tall. I've just worked out. I thought that was perspective. I thought I was looking into it, but I'm not. It, oh. <sighs> Casual casual discussion he's he's having a casual discussion with with a lady that's nice <coughs> I want to get out of this I have um, seriously lost control of what I'm doing he, he, he <laughs> this is a fascinating conversation he's having um, he was just telling her about money I don't know what he's up to and she's talking about her phone it seems very realistic in the world doesn't it yeah, oh they... another lady's come over to tell me I've got a nice hat that's nice oh yeah. and now she's talking about planes and flying and the other girl's talking about wine and cheese <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm seriously lost um <laughs> Right, how, can I, where's the, if there should be a way of binning what I've made. I need to bin what I've made because I have no clue what I've made and quite frankly I'm a bit frightened by it. So I need to... I've got a giant, basically, I mean you're going to laugh your ass off when you watch this back because essentially what I've done for the last 10 minutes is build a sort of wonky, giant, tiny house Um move the camera around the neighborhood up and down like a sort of old man playing a game right oh what what does this do what's happening which one am i and um and now i can't even work out how to no i don't want to build on top of it uh, what's no what does that do just make it go down make things normal sized oh i need to spin it around i've got this stupid stupid angle of uh, Make a square house. Why can lines not match up? No, don't go into the ground. <laughs> Stupid. Make it, make it stop, Mike. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It's scary. Hey. <laughs> I may have just got a date. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I'm just losing money. I'm hemorrhaging money, and on all I've got is <laughs> is a corridor. I've built a corridor. There's no walls. <laughs> oh no, she's got a child. We're not interested. <laughs> I've got a door on it. Go in the house. How do I control my sim then? Uh, you can push him around and um, and oh. sort of like um, select. You can like you can sort of select where you want to go and say move here using a cursor. Right, go into the new corridor house that we've built. Come on, you know you want to. I'm going to go with a heartfelt compliment. Go home. Go into your house. Yes, that is your house. Don't look at it disdainfully. You live here. Oh, Kimba. Acquired the charisma Kimber. skill. Mike's new Show skill is charisma. Uh -huh. Will allow him to successfully oh. joke more frequently and learn other sims Just faster. Honest, more varied types of interaction free. unlock at higher oh, levels. Lampima. That's nice. Um, for some reason... A lady just walked away. I pulled out my phone and I started thinking about llamas. Now, I have no <laughs> idea. <laughs> Why would I do that? Who's this guy? Um, Go and get him. Um, I like I, I like her. Let's go. Let's let's go ask her something, shall we? Let's keep picking on the same woman. <laughs> Just because it's. I have no idea what else to do. I am seriously lost at this point. I'm. Um, I've done nothing. I, I I literally have done nothing. I I don't understand how building really works. Um, I, I, I so, she's just stood on the curb, just uh, hating everything about me. I, I've got a um, I don't know what I've got. Uh, 
Who's that? So I've got a I, I've, I've got a suggestion. Mm-hmm. How about we um, at this point um, break and uh, continue to play for a little bit, see if we can solve some problems, and uh, then uh, for you, dear viewer, it will be a matter of moments, but for us, it may be some time. I might have a house when you come back. So we've put some hours, some of us uh, more productive hours than others, into <laughs> Sim 4. Um, and, uh, well, 3T, let's start, as ever, with um, <laughs> um, play- playability and replayability. Okay, so... <laughs> um, I, I, I would like to make it clear that I am... I do have working opposable thumbs, and I am able <laughs> to generally play video games and uh, use simple tools um, but uh, yeah um, I think it's a hard one I don't want to be I don't want to be unfair because I was the architect of my own destruction <laughs> in the first mm. half of that video I think <clears throat> realistically we try and avoid tutorials I think if I had played a tutorial I would have probably known to choose a house you knew without one <laughs> But if I had just chosen a house and started playing, I think I would have had a lot more fun initially. Um, I honestly, I think it's the whole build mechanic. I'm glad we both did different things. As much as it destroyed my soul <laughs> to be doing nothing um, in the initial thoughts, I think it showed two very dis- different parts of that game and it was quite useful that I was so rubbish and that you were just getting on with the story um, because the the build mechanic I think could be a lot of fun if you've got the time, if you've got endless hours to sink into building a little doll's house for your little sea monkey sims to run around in good for you um, Get on, I'm sure it's brilliant um, the <sighs> I, that's what I'm going to comment on because I I have played the rest the, the other type I have done a sort of bit of moving around but I'm going to let you talk about that but I think I think it is it's a very steep learning curve if you decide and if you and written we did and it's our own fault if you tell the game I'm all right I've played games before <laughs> then then you are you 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 reap what you sow um I I I think. I think it could be a lot of fun. I don't think it's necessarily something that I would like to sink a lot of time into as a a building game. Um, but uh, I, I, you haven't really done the building. What What's your opinion of the playability of the the other side of The Sims? Well, after watching um, <laughs> your video, um, ah. I'm glad I didn't. I'm glad I didn't have to uh, try and work out how to build something. I mean, I'm get again. I guess if you follow the tutorial and you understand how it works, and you're into creating luxury villas and mansions for your um, like your your little sort of pets and things like that, then mm. then yeah, maybe. But but even the the playability, um, there were aspects of it that uh, again. I had to guess, but then again, it was my fault because I didn't watch the tutorial. Mm. Um, took me a long time to work out that there was this add um, add to party. Um, I, I, it wasn't add to party. It was like you can go somewhere uh, or you could click on a house and add them to your group of friends. Yeah. And it took me a long time to understand because I thought I was adding that house to my to my uh, property and <laughs> and it was only afterwards i realized that no i'm adding them to my group of friends ah. mm. um but it took me a while to sort of understand that i had to kind of build relationships with the other characters and then to work try and work out who they were and i mean because i was flirting with a married woman for a very long time and wondering <laughs> why she was leading me on and every time i um um the, and every, every time I, I i proposed the next level she'd get angry and leave and, I, <laughs> and it was like oh she's married that's why <laughs> and yet her character was flirty, and it was like, well, I don't understand. Um, so there was weird aspects of it, um, but at the end of the day, um, uh, I, I, 
yeah, I sort of enjoyed doing it, but it kind of got a little bit boring. It was like, I have to do this in the real world. I have to fake this for real. Why do I want to do it in a game? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you know what I mean. Yes. Um, and uh, so, yeah. Okay, we had very different, I think, initial launch. Um, <laughs> launch launch conditions were slightly different. Yeah. Uh, but um, I think the game just became monotonous as it went on because it was the same thing again and again and yeah i mean i, I haven't tried to re rebuild my house and i haven't tried to build a house but then after watching <laughs> what you were doing i don't want to no. um so that didn't help me um help me go any further and then you know moving on to our second um second sort of um criteria about hidden catches yeah there were so many ac extra things that you had to add into the game so many um well like not, va vanity packs not and that you like have expansion to expansion mods but that it expects oh. you to <clears throat> yeah i mean when you have a game and that the there's a little small print um next to the download icon that says may include in-game purchases yeah. you think ah okay yeah you know even um even that energy drink motocross game didn't have that little catch there may be <laughs> hidden you know no, you know i mean it did have that catch but it didn't actually have it written well um, and i did i did go out and buy a hell of a lot of energy drinks for some reason i don't know why well, just after we uh, after we stopped playing that game uh, <laughs> I, I got i got a lot of uh, i got a lot of um advertising for energy drinks after playing that, <laughs> I think that somebody might be listening um but uh, but yeah i mean so so to be honest um the hidden catches they were there i mean they didn't affect our play no. but i think if i'd have carried on i mean there's only so much you can do with the vanilla basics i think it's the it, what's going on the effect is that you would go oh well i'll just i'll go and have a look at uh, maybe i'll go and buy a, a, some more hats or maybe i'll go and buy some more different things uh, i you know it's it's not you don't need them to play the game but there are a lot of people who will just go oh I'll just buy it oh, i'll just buy this oh it's the just purchase, buy that. it's the purchase golden gun theory mm. um if you unlock a golden gun and you earn the golden gun by earning it then yes, but if you buy it, then it's worthless. It's just eye candy. Yeah, um, I mean that that would know, be good. I mean, I mean, I yeah. mean to be honest, to, to be honest, I mean I'd, I'd rather have a lynx rather than a golden gun. But that's another story. <laughs> if you had to earn, I'm moving over that. If you <laughs> if you had to earn all the extra things, uh, or if they were unlocked, because obviously you're given um, things to do, you're given. Um, tasks and goals to achieve like you know piss off a certain number of people or learn how to mix drinks or you know make friends with so, so many people <laughs> kick, kick, kick over three dustbins kick over three For dustbins no and that's brilliant and if that if those things if achieving those things led to unlocking all of the extra stuff that you have to buy um and, and maybe it does maybe after a bit more time maybe you do start unlocking things i no, i've I, given I, it the I minimum don't. amount of time that I needed. I, to, I don't. I don't think. I don't think it does. I think that. I mean, I didn't even go to work. Um, I think you do <laughs> that kind of stuff to get money, um, so that you can actually lead your lifestyle. Because you're always um, frivoling. Fr the money is always frivolously going away. And I'm guessing that when you get down to a balance of zero, um, you might even be able to add game credits in. I, I didn't get down to zero, so I don't know. But no. um, I think the tasks are like for in-game money for your character. Um, for sim dollars or whatever they are um, yeah. and again um, <clears throat> that becomes a hidden catch for me um, uh, I mean okay I like the fact that there's a resource element in there and, and we'll talk about games that are similar that have resource management and there's a finite amount of things that you can have but the instant that you have a market where you can buy things from the outside you devalue any effort that you've actually put in to create anything and that's just how I look at it yeah. it doesn't matter if it's a first person shooter third person shooter or if it's a top down god type game um, yeah no um, I think that if it wasn't in the sandpit when you when the starting condition was there, or there isn't a way to create the extra resources within the sandpit that was there when you created the game, I think at that point um, I lose my interest in the game. Um, and and I, again, when we talk about games which are similar, I'll explain why games that are the games that I would prefer to invest my time in. 
and why they have that and this didn't for well, me well let's so. let's move straight on to that then because i think uh, i think that's a natural segue what what do you think because i've been trying to think of of what would be similar but just carry on with that thought well for creating type things we can go back to the settlers type games okay um, yeah, where yeah you have resource you're building houses um a recent game um that is very similar when uh you were talking about um uh sea monkeys and mm-hmm, like mm-hmm. ant farms and things Tamagotchis. like that oxygen <laughs> yeah oxygen not included for example oh okay. uh, this is where you you um you have like uh three guys um that are um in an area underground and you have to work out how to keep them alive but you run out of resources that you there is there is a it's a there's it's a zero sum game i think is what it is there's no way to keep eventually your your trash basically kills you off uh because you there you 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 just have to keep expanding otherwise you run out of resources and eventually you can't expand anymore um, that's one. And then, of course, uh, Universum is another, which is a type of god game very similar to Settlers, where you um, you are god, and you have to get um, your settlers have to believe in you so that then they give you pow- powers so that you can actually make them... Um, you can make them happy so you can heal them and you can help them build things and as you help them build things they have more faith faith in you and therefore you and so that's another one and then of course there's the classic minecraft um minecraft's another game where you are controlling but um the difference there is that suddenly i don't have to worry about so whereas oxygen um not included they have a little mind of their own they'll go and sleep when they're tired unless you tell them not to and they'll eat when they're hungry unless you tell them not to universum everyone is doing their own thing settlers you know you're giving them tasks but also they're doing their own thing whereas minecraft suddenly you're in complete control of what you're doing but again you're building and this is a game where i'd rather spend time building because it's building for me not building for somebody with their own you know that someone who's going to go off and decide to set fire to the place just because they can <laughs> um and then the last one i'll throw in is like stardew valley for example another one where you're actually managing but you're again more active so so they're, they're the sort of types of games for building it would be um perhaps uh oxygen not included um stardew valley minecraft they're just the first three that come to my head for the sort of running people's lives who have their own sort of fourth thought process perhaps settlers definitely universum okay. um but like tamagotchi as well i mean you know that's the way it is it, that, that that was what i was thinking of and and um um yeah that, that that's that's my you know initial thoughts on it yeah um i can't think of any other games i mean, settlers was brilliant i used to love that but um it's like being a it's like living it working in a care home you know this person their needs are they need to go to the toilet well, go to the toilet then i shouldn't have to pick you up and put you there i'm hungry all right well you know where the fridge is like why <laughs> pointing pointing somebody at a fridge and saying have a foot have a meal you know pointing somebody at the toilet and saying use the toilet putting them in bed i See, don't find that necessarily entertaining See, my guy, sometimes he did it himself and sometimes he didn't, which was really weird. Um, mm. Well, you know, that's the thing. Oh, I know. I, I, I know the, the, other, the other one that's just popped in. High Rise is another one that's just popped into my head, which is when we build a high rise and you have, have to manage a, a high rise tower. But again, that's a little bit less... Um, that's more of a building game. That's the trouble. It, it's, 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 um, I, I don't really like games where my protagonist just decides to go and do what the hell he likes. I think, um, can, you imagine, can you imagine playing Hitman and the, 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 the agent just decides to go off on a killing spree on his own? That would be weird. Well, here's here's <laughs> one that's just popped into my head. If you, if you wanted a game where you had to build structures and achieve things uh, and have a population of people who will have their own ways and things to do, Prison Architect, really quite cheap. Oh, and that's on PS4 yes. as well. I had forgotten Prison Architect. Yes, Prison Architect is the same thing where you can like get a riot going. Brilliant and like fun. And then, of course, there is the um, escape one where you can actually, uh, on the PC, you can take a prison that you've designed in Prison Architect and you can try and escape from it yourself, which is actually oh, quite amazing. fun. <laughs> I know. And you suddenly go, why did I build it like this? But it, it's, oh, my God, I'll never escape. It's that. a game where you actually feel like you're achieving something, even though it is, again, again a fish also... tank type game. <laughs> Yeah, but there's things that that but that's what Universum is like. There is there's a like you you know they have their own mind, but you also have a certain amount of control. Whereas with Sims, you have a control, but they have their own mind. But the two don't 
it, it I don't didn't care as much. Do it for me. <laughs> no. no, no. I mean, I, 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 I just, I, it wasn't, it wasn't my cup of tea, unfortunately. I mean, don't get me wrong. It was all right while I was playing it, um, and you know, I, I. I, I I sort of set my own little mission. I'm going to uh, I'm going to chat up a lady and get her to move in with me. And I started with a married woman and I ended up with a pizza delivery girl and um, you know that kind of thing. Uh, but, but at the end of the day, um, it, it was like I, I look back and I think, why why was I doing that? It doesn't make any sense. It was yeah. like um, so. I mean that that's that's the thing. I mean it it it, it games that it's it it it's it's both similar and dissimilar to all the games that I've mentioned because it's it's its own thing. I mean, it is it is uh, again the Sim, Sim like Sim City and things like that. And there's another good building game, yeah. Sim City, the Sim City franchise um, is another building game. But um, well. um, and and I'm trying to think of the there's, there's loads of little reality type games that you can play um, that popped up all around the same time as the original Sims, but. I think um, most people are familiar with the, the idea of The Sims as well. So it's, um, I, yeah, I suppose just a, some, some suggestions for things that might be more along the same lines, but maybe more entertaining. I think that's quite a good list that we've just uh, we've just dished out, or you have mostly. Mm. Um, Sorry, I just I just rat- rattled them off because that's, that's good, sort though. of like the, the 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 games that I can think of. I mean, and again, I'm thinking of other games. Um, but I can't think of their names. Um, that's the problem. It's trying to think of the name of the game. But the games that I, I would prefer from that list are the games where I have slightly more control over my actor and or protagonists, you know, where I tell them what to do. Um, the exception to that would actually be Universum, where you can just walk away for an hour and come back and see if they've, like, killed themselves or set fire to their village or discovered... Um, discovered fire or something, you know. <laughs> um, um, so I suppose just moving on, then, would you say it's worth the hard drive space and time? Um, it didn't take very long to download. Um, it was sixteen point five uh, one gigabytes in size. Mine downloaded in a matter of uh, less than two hours, um, less than an hour, an hour, two hours, something like that. I don't really know. Um, uh, no <laughs> and you <laughs> N- not to me but um i would say it's actually quite a good deal if you are interested in the sims game um i it's probably worth it it doesn't take too long to download it's uh it doesn't take up that much space as far as i know and you know what as much as I didn't get on with it, it is a quality product. It does what you expect it to do, pretty much. So, it's probably worth it, but not for me. I I would say the same. Um, I would say this has been a very good month because um, not only do you get uh, Firewall Zero Hour, which uh, apparently is a game which uh, utilizes the uh, virtual reality headset of uh, the PlayStation system. Very nice. I mean, if you haven't got a one at it you never know you might get one um and of course bioshock um the collection is quite good bioshock shock in itself is a not a game you want to play on your own at night by the way just just uh, just an <laughs> fyi out there um and the sims and all of them were actually quite high value games i mean bioshock um the playstation reckoned it was uh, 49 euros and the sims was also 49 euros uh, when you know it was up so yeah. they, we're not talking about cheap games um so yeah i mean the question is um would i have paid for it uh would i have paid for the sims no i think if i haven't bought a sims game by now i don't (laughs) think i'm going to pay for it bioshock yes i would have uh bought it but unfortunately i've already played through uh played through it with someone so i've already gone through it but that said I did enjoy it, and it does have branching paths, so you could play it. And Bioshock, the collection, probably means that it's also got the expansion packs and it's got the the bigger footprint. So, um, yeah, yeah I, 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 again, I'm trying to sort of find positives. So Bioshock, yes. The Sims, no. Uh, Firewall Zero Hour, no, because I don't have a virtual headset. But hey, if it's free, add it to your collection. Uh, yeah. What about you? No, I wouldn't. I, I would go with the same. I've obviously I've played a Sims game in the past, but uh, it has never inspired me to get the next ones. Um, it's uh, yeah, it's good value. 
um it's it's quite a good month i think uh for playstation plus so if you uh yeah definitely add it to your library give it a go if you haven't uh if you if you're at all curious or you you were meaning to buy it um definitely get it but i would not have paid for it myself i i'll echo your sentiment there is that i've had ample opportunity uh and uh it hasn't happened so far so uh with that this is 3t and this is Mike Papa Foxtrot, and we were looking at The Sims 4 that is currently freeloadable from the PlayStation Network for February 2020.